Uh, Jamal Shedd has developed into a elite level defender. I thought he just absolutely set the tone for Houston's defense. He gets down to the stands and he really guards. Well, they smell blood in the water early, Mike. They do. Newton. The shot clock is down to five. Miles. That's why right now he's my pick for the National Coach of the Year. Well, he's brought this team together and they're playing like it. Shed. Small Shed. He was projected to be out for one or two weeks. Ball pressure in your face. Three, two, one, finish, Jamal Shedd. And one of his players comes in and yells fluke because we had beat him the night before. 22 to two run right now here for Houston. Shot clock again. Familiar situation wow. for ECU. Having a horse hole oh, and yeah. to do that. Get that offensive line. Blocking side by Shed. Just tremendous effort. And then Shed comes from behind. Mike, they just never give up on a play. Caring about your teammates and your brothers. They were over at the house. They set a player together. He's Ball is stripped. He is a hard nosed, tough defender. White has tied his career high now with a 19. Hughes underneath just had it taken away by Shed. And then Shed looks off a defender and finishes. Put that on the Jamal Shed highlight reel. Good job cutting off that drive by. He's quietly developing into one of the premier defenders in the country. And not just when he's on the ball, but I've been so impressed with his off the ball defense. Yeah, he's got his hands full with Jamal Shedd. Shedd with the steal. Tenacious defense from Houston. That is a valuable point guard right there. On cue, Shedd with the steal and the run out. They have to go all the way out. Ball stolen by Shedd. I think the one have to back it out. They, they just, boy, how do you talk about, it's like playing basketball with a swarm of gnats in your face. Stolen. Shedd has it. Throws it down. Right, so Oliveri cannot find separation. Good help by Josh Carlton. Another turnover for the corner. Open threes being missed by Rice now. And look at the toughness. Jamal Shedd with the strip. 24 point lead. The largest of the night for the Cougars. And the defensive intensity continues. He had three first half steals. Yeah, that's point guard blocking six foot ten inch Riley Abercrombie. What a great play by Jamal Shedd. Man, that is excellent. The pass. Where did he come from? You see in the ESPN app. Beautifully read on the defensive end by Houston to get that steal and score. And Carlton turned it over. Oh, and what a play by Shedd. He had a layup. He was on his strong side, too. Franklin will get called for the offensive foul. Well, look how in the second half you've seen Houston there on the team. Pass deflected. Shed again. <laughs> and Shed read it perfectly. Outstretched arms, tipped it the other way. Could have had a foul call there, but went right into the body. Slowed down just a bit, put the brakes on, and then right went right into the body. I am a huge fan of Jamal Shedd, the way he plays. He's just a, his motor never stops revving. Just talking about his motor, and that motor revved again. Goes to one corner. Mm. Build a wall, stop the ball. Exactly what Houston did in a motion play like that. Shed just stays in your jersey. He doesn't give you any breathing room when you're handling that ball, and he's defending you. And he was nowhere near the player he is now last year. Jamal Shed all the credit right there. It was a mismatch. Boone had the size advantage, but Shed was hounding him. Count me as a Jamal Shed fan. Just been off the charts. Nine nothing run. Houston Shed with the steal. He has that vibe on defense. He expects to get a steal every defensive possession. It's just tough, and you know the the, the adjustment for him. Hasn't been the fit, but, but then you have to look at the team that, that just does everything with intensity. It's a different why Murphy forced into a tough shot. Nice defense by Shed. Wichita State. He's 
That's Shed. And that's the sixth turnover. Number of your shots. That's where Wichita State has struggled mightily. And another turnover doesn't help the case either. Quay Grant turned it over and Shed goes coast to coast. Grant is at home. And now Steele, Shed 10. Shed for a tie-up, and there it is. Watching to see if it's his ankle, but he is just so tough around the basketball. Shed puts his hands on the ball. It's his ball. Nobody's going to take it out of his hands. South Florida the push this time, and Shed takes it away. Four-inch freshman can really move, but outstanding transition defense by Jamal Shed. Perfect. Shed looking for the post. Right when he touches the ball in the paint. So there's Shed with almost a... Teams at him. You got to do something to take the ball out of his hand. Well, Shed just took it away from DeJulia. <laughs> First half. Second half is underway. Davis got it straight. Will trigger it in for Memphis to start the second half. Starting five is out there for Memphis. Quinones, Williams, Nolly, and Duran with him. Turnover all of the last four minutes. Lead up for Phillip. Shed up by 18 with a minute no. 14 to go. No. Still diving on the floor. Frank Porter Jr. sheds all over him. He's going to get the steal. Out. You got to battle. You got to match that intensity. And here's a steal by Shed. Oh! No look underneath, and it's taken away. Shed, how many times has he done that? Has the rebound. Shed just stood his ground and built the fence right there. Jamal Shed's dominating this game. Shed dives on the floor with Dennis. Started his dive on the floor for the loose ball. Ten feet away from the ball. First guy to the floor wins. Five. He's first guy to the floor. He comes up with it. They tie him up. Man, that is selling out for the loose ball. I'm a fan. Hook. Hook hands by Jamal Shedd. Jalen Cook to the basket. Blocked by Shed. Oh, what a defensive play that was. Very vulnerable. Ames and Shed. A couple of Bulldogs going at it. In 25 years, they've not beaten a ranked. Look at Shed anticipating yeah. pass. You can see it coming. And Shed throws it down. Second in the American Conference. Nearly two steals per game. He's already got two. And here's Shed contesting the inbound. Out of bounds. And suddenly Shed is like the focal point. He's the, the captain out there who runs things. And I can't overstate it enough. He's embraced the opportunity. He seized it. A deflection. Here comes Shed again. Off the backboard to Moore. And three against quad one opponents. This is a quad one game in Memphis. That's either. Durant has his hands. Stripped away by Shed. Shed. Going to challenge low match though. He's going to feed it to Moore. The fatigue, I think, more than anything. It's passed down low and foul on the floor. But to see the Tigers come out today and play hard. And they got. And Tulane. Big loss. He's playing his best basketball of his life the last couple of weeks. Houston, both ends of the floor. What a dominating first half performance. No, rebound by Duran. And a leak ahead. Quinones. Shed got back. Away. From Puerto Rico. Look oh, a this. nice knock away by Shed. The steal. Moore floats to the right. Turnovers. Man, what a that's steal that, there by just, Shed. That's Shed great timing. Evie called for the charge, drawn by Jamal Shed. Who had Jamal Shed, a sophomore from Maynard, Texas. Another steal. This time, Jamal Shed. Yeah, the mental mistakes that you have to eliminate versus this Villanova team is so crucial to how you're able to. Villanova back in the Elite Eight for the first time since 2018, their championship season. Shed all over Gillespie, trying to shake him. Defense of the Cougars. Allie LaForce will give you a more detailed report on Creasa, but he is back, and that is a significant storyline. Tournament, and all in the same city. There's a turnover. Shed on the breakaway, lays it in. Give up on the play, and we'll get the ball back. Man, Shed just crashing in. I mean, he is a hard-nosed, tough defender. He is selfless. He's excelling at his role. I'm telling you, this kid is going to be a star.